Hi everyone, welcome. Thanks to all new subscribers. Thanks for the support, everyone. Guys, I love you all for the comments, the amazing comments we're getting. Isn't this beautiful? Beautiful surface of the moon in ultra high definition, of course, for whatever it may um, be as a quality here, I don't know, but say to yourself, by me upping the quality in my formats, it's only going to give you guys a better view. Beautiful color. Yes, color, surface of the moon. We, we talk about space and the moon, it should be color. Boom, Mare Fecunditatis, the supposed satellite or bridge or structures. We're looking at green around the surface. We're looking at grays, browns, all the color of the spectrum of the rainbow. This is the real surface of the moon. We And see the structures? Guys, the structures are not small, but of course, very close to the surface, all right? We'd have to go 400,000 kilometers over Earth to see uh, the surface. Trust me, this is the best we get. This is very real, and I've compared it with real photos, untouched photos. Yes, this, these anomalies are all on the surface lines and strips connected to domes wow isn't this one amazing do we all remember this one archimedes crater the side wall don't forget um the side wall so this would be coming out of the side of it guys i'm gonna let you look at the rest of this it's just uh, i'm gonna tell you exactly where we are this is at the bottom of mare serenitatis okay and this is where the, the, the rest of the video is going to be. You'll see all this area very properly. Um, could the, the craters have glass bubbles over them? I don't know. But look at the setups here. These are massive installations. I'm going to prove it. I swear to God they're there. This is not a joking a matter. Take a look at these structures. Yeah, they're a little blurry because I had to zoom up on them. And that's how... Um, I'm showing them right now, and these are the cities I'm going to clarify. Why should I hide it and wait till they're super um, clear? Maybe they never will be. It's important to get these out as soon as I can. Guys, enjoy this video. This is mesmerizing. Whatever you guys want to make of these structures, objects, anomalies being up there, um, you know, I'm not here to change your belief systems. I'm not here to... Uh, pry information into your head. I'm just telling you that what, what is up there is not what we were told. So, Mare Serenitatis. And don't forget, at the end of this video, guys, I will show you exactly where it is because we're going to zoom out. Look at all the structuring on the surface. This is very real, and this is what's up there. And the whole world has to know this because we've been told the opposite. I don't care why we were told the opposite, whether it be national security or not. All I know is that I have the right to know what's up there. You know why? Because the system forced us to have religions down here, all right? And that was a load of uh, malarkey, a load of bullcrap. Why? Because this, finding structures on the surface of the moon, changes everything. It is something that affects all countries, religions, cultures, people on the entire face of this earth.
So this is zoomed out, guys. This is where we're looking at to the right of Mare Serenitatis. That's all it is, nothing hiding. And look at these platform-like objects. These are long, guys, probably a couple hundred miles. See, Mare Serenitatis is at the top left. And this is the area so where we're looking at the structure, the nothing hiding. hiding. And this is where we're seeing all the massive structuring. Well, Sinus Iridum in this photo is just at the top left here. And you could see Bessel craters right there as that line of supposed ejecta goes through uh, Mare Serenitatis. So we go to the bottom of Mare Serenitatis. These are structures. You can clearly see them. Look at them. Slow it down. I'm running through this. Imagine. I can make this go on for hours. There we go. Here it is right at the bottom. What everyone notices, all the ones with telescopes know what I'm talking about. Looks like a wall, right? Sort of a maze-like wall, but look at them. And look how it's connected. And now I'm going to go low enough to uh, join Mare, uh, sorry, the Apennine Mountains. And we're going to go all the way down to and stop at Eratosthenes Crater, because Eratosthenes is at the end. So here, we're just at the bottom of Mare Serenitatis. We're going to go downwards and off to the left there and follow and join up with Montes Apenninus, the Apennine Mountains. You'll see it here. We're coming up to it, there it is. Those are the Apennine Mountains, and there's Eratosthenes Crater. To give you an idea of where I'm finding these structures.